Next news is out of Fort Worth, Texas. City of Fort Worth is getting heat for, quote, unquote, in No God We Trust, banners put up legally by atheist group. The city of Fort Worth is receiving complaints after someone put up banners that say, in No God We Trust, on downtown light posts. The city said Metroplex atheists purchased the banners that are currently displayed in several downtown locations. The city explained, while some residents might not like the messaging on these banners, we do not currently restrict religious messaging as long as it follows the current policy and procedures displayed for the banner. Now, I do want to point out that the mayor of Fort Worth um, had something to say about this. And it was actually pretty cool because the second I heard that the mayor jumped in and her first bit of words, I kind of rolled my eyes, but she finished it off with a bang. Uh, Betsy Price said, I was appalled when the banners were currently being displayed downtown as I do not support or agree with this message. While many of us may not agree with the message, the, organi the organization did follow policies and procedures set forth by the city and downtown Fort Worth Incorporated. We must respect freedom of speech. As we approach 4th of July, we must remember that many Americans have fought and died for the freedoms we cherish today. So, awesome. This mayor is saying, I don't agree with these signs, but I absolutely agree with their right to be there. Um, and is, is reminding other people of that same thing. So, I thought that was pretty cool. I mean, it's still a little bit bullshit that she had to say, I don't agree with this sign. Like, you're a mayor. We don't really give, right. you, you don't <laughs> give a shit that you agree with it or not. But we'll take it. We'll accept it. Like, okay. So, she. I mean, it's still ridiculous that she was offended by saying a sign that she doesn't agree with. I mean, we don't like it. Well, you, it doesn't. Who cares that you don't like it, right? But again, as given how far we are um, from actually atheists being able to, no atheism being normalized, um, well, t well th we don't want to be too picky. The fact that she says, I don't agree it, but freedom of speech, go with the banners. We'll take that win. It's really good. Yeah. Thank you so much, um, Mayor, that you're letting atheists have their banner, even though you're offended. This is really good. Whether this, what organization this is, we should really give them mention the name again because then this is this is a really good way of normalizing atheism right like absolutely putting, yeah they're More, uh they're called metroplex atheists and they're holding an event on july 14th 2019 hmm. um that's going to be in fort worth and it's going to be open to the public Me great metroplex atheists and go find them go to their event um, go support them. Go support them because this is the kind of see. This is the kind of activism that we need. Good job, Metroplex atheists. Like really good job. If you're in that area, please go support their event. Um, I mean, stuff like this. Just people saying that hey, yeah, atheism is a thing. There are atheists out there. There are people that don't believe in God. It just helps normalize it. it helps it make like meh. Okay, fine. There are atheists. It's good. Normalize it, right? This right. Is, this is exactly the kind of, and this is such a simple but yet powerful way of make making that happen. Um, and again, could again, again, uh, kudos to the mayor for just saying, yeah, I don't like it, but free speech. Um, let me see. Uh, top comment saying, I've never seen a group of people who claim to be so sure of themselves feel the need to so often proclaim their righteousness. Are you talking about atheists? <laughs> <laughs> well stop talking about atheism the moment atheism is not seen as demonic or hate uh, hateful or a crime or or when people are not being put in prison for atheism or being jailed or tortured for it when that happens we'll stop talking about atheism yep okay? tan is saying freedom of speech i'm right next to fort, uh, fort worth is that right I, yep. for one, am proud. Well, Ken, be more than just being proud. If you're there, go to their event and show your support. Okay? Just get off the, the screen sometimes. And I mean, it's good that you're watching us. Don't get off the screen now. But do, do more than that. Go out in the, in the world and actually do these kind of activism. And join these events. Show your support. Do something. Rod is saying a small dose of what we experience every day. Andrew saying, hey, they respected our right to free speech. This is a new one. It's not a new one, but it's good. Atheists are under attack in many places. If they were Christians, their voices would be heard. If they were Jews, their voices would be heard. If they were Muslims, their voices would be heard. But they are atheists, and not many seem to be listening. Let's make it difficult for them to ignore us. 
we have built a global community and now we are tearing down geographic, cultural and language barriers so we can find each other and support each other. In the last decade, we have built the largest atheist community in the world. Now we are doing the same in other languages. With your help, we have started Atheist Republic in Persian and Arabic. انضميت مؤخرا لأسرة Atheist Republic وحيصير عندي بودكاست باللغة العربية. As we grow, we can dedicate more time, staff and resources to start doing the same in Spanish, Portuguese, Malay, Bengali, Urdu, Hindi and other languages. We are providing community, support, informative content and amplifying the voices of those who need protection, especially in countries where people feel isolated simply for their lack of belief. We want to be there for them and we are only getting started. Help us get there. Check in the description for ways you can support our projects.